The following segment is sponsored by Intermountain Healthcare and the Utah Department of Health. Well, Governor Gary Herbert just declared September Healthy Family Meals Month. And we have Rebecca Fromberg here from Epic Program at the Utah Department of Health to tell us how we can have more healthy family meals. Well, you, know, you have to work at it. You do. It does require effort. And we're not saying that people have to always, you know, prepare the meals and eat together as a family. Mm -hmm. Just eating together as a family is good. However, it's nicer if you can actually prepare them and make them healthier. Um, they've shown that family meals help with a lot of different things. Of course, in my program, we're concerned with the how that helps reduce obesity, mm -hmm. but it's also helped with things like even preventing suicide and um, improving communication and building stronger bonds between um, families. So I had my kids help me, I mean, in the kitchen, help mm -hmm. prepare dinner, and I found that it, they were more likely to eat it if they helped fix it. Oh, yeah. And even but it more was also bonding. I mean, it didn't yeah. happen every night, but... Well, and even, you know, growing a garden together and going mm -hmm. out and picking the things from the garden, then they know where they came from and then preparing them together. I mean, all of that can lead, you know, to, to being healthier. And you don't, like you said, you don't have to fix the meal together yourself, but just that sitting around, mm -hmm. that bonding time yes. is what's important. It, it can help kids with their schoolwork, right? You bet. We see it improved in academics. We see um, improved physical activity, all kinds of things. You think, well, how does nutrition improve physical activity? Well, just being together, you know, maybe we go take a walk after our family meal, mm -hmm. something like that, that can really help the kids, you know, connect with their parents better and um, all the things that can help us develop those healthy habits. Yeah, we're looking at the list here, the success in school, also better high, better self-esteem, mm -hmm. higher self-esteem, oh, they yeah. feel better about themselves, lower obesity, and improved communication. I love that, improving communication with your parents. I mean, they start talking and asking questions at the dinner table absolutely. and they might be more willing to talk to you later when they're running into trouble when they have the tough stuff coming on okay. absolutely yeah. and you have two websites where people can go for more help yep Utah family meals uh, org and choose health .gov are both great resources family friendly recipes things that you can do to eat together okay and strengthen your family absolutely thanks so much thank great you advice.